Hey yo, welcome back. This is Ty Ty. So this is going to be a three-part series, learning your buses. Today, we're going to go ahead and hop in and cover the mix bus first. Let's go. All right, so I'm going to do these videos in the order of kind of how I would go about mixing. I always start with my mix bus, lead vox, all vox. Let's go ahead and hop in, and we're going to check it out. All right, so we're going to go ahead and hop in like it's just fresh recorded. Um, we ain't done nothing yet, hypothetically. So I got everything deactivated, and this is typically what my template looks like. And I don't typically use everything. So then starting off here, the first insert, I always run some type of preamp. Uh, you can run a Neve API, but I do really like this uh, McDSP. Um, but basically, we're just going to push a little bit of drive and just kind of start sculpting that sound. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm Irish, in love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich, I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all, step on the street, kept me a stick, it's a matter of time, I fuck, then hopping into an EQ down here, basically I do have a lot of my uh, setup here, kind of roughly based off of the way Jason Joshua does it, he does a lot of it through Ozone, um, but for me, I like variety so for example let me just take this uh, preamp off real quick and I'll throw in a Neve I'm searching for peace looking for clarity policy diamonds on my wrist in love with the hustle I came from the struggle ain't gonna stop until I'm rich I'm on a beach popping a seal I wanna own it all slept on the street kept me a and that's about all you really need to do with that alright then hopping into the Pro Q3 Got a little bit of a cut down here just to kind of take off some low end energy. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds on my wrist. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street. So it just kind of pulls everything together just a little bit. And then I got a bump here at 105 hertz just to kind of bring some body into it. Let's go ahead and see. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds on my wrist. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a stick, it's a matter. Just really adds a lot of character. And then over here, I got a little bit of cut in the 600 range. Just kind of cleans it up just a little bit. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds on my wrist. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm One more time on that. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds on my wrist. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna. Just really allows, in my opinion, that the vocals just, just, they just pop through a lot better. And then up here in the 2700 range, we got a little bit of a wider boost. But it's still, these are micro adjustments being on the master bus. You don't want it to be multiple dB because you're going to handle a lot of your heavy lifting in your other buses. So with the little bump up here, let's see what it does. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds on my wrist. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a stick, it's a matter of time. Definitely adds a bunch of presence to the vocals. Just kind of getting a little bit of that separation. Um, but then one thing that I don't have on this one, but I will do a lot of times is I'll do a high pass up here and I typically I won't go under 2100, but like the way it just rolls off the highs, it kind of, to me, it kind of glues everything together and just makes everything sound a little more cohesive and just polished. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds on my wrist. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a stick, it's a matter of time. I'm fucking that bitch with no brakes, sipping this lean out of state, brand new Rolls Royce out of space. Look at these pearls, I got cake. I fuck with this bitch on the south side, I'ma beat it up, fade away. I left that little bitch on the south side, got a loud mouth, no way. I like how that sounded about 28,000. Um, but then moving on past that, running some more saturation here. Basically, I got it set up 
on the Saturn II. Um, I personally think a multiband saturator is going to work best in this type of situation. You know, you could use other things, but I just like being able to push it in other areas. So on the low, I have a warm tape. I'm pushing my drive about 21%. Let me go ahead and just shut these off, and then we'll walk it in one by one. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris, in love with the hustle, I came from the struggle. Alright, so when I bring this in, really pay attention to what it does to the bass and just the low end in general. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris, in love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a steep, it's a matter of time. I'm fucking that bitch with no brakes, sipping this lean out of state. A bass is thumping. <laughs> Alright, so then in the mids here, I'm running a clean tape, and I'm not pushing it very hard at all. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slip on the street. See the bit of clarity that that just brings to the vocals. Um, I mean, this is basically where most of the vocals is sitting. Um, and it does, it just brings a lot of character to it. And then we'll bring a little bit of clean tape up on the highs and just kind of bring that fancy sound. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a steep, it's a matter of time. I'm fucking that bitch with no brakes, sipping this lean out of state. I don't want to push that too hard, you know, things will kind of start to get harsh. Um, but, like we said, we got a lot of work to do in the other boxes uh, before this thing is complete. But, uh, yeah, I think that's sitting pretty good for the moment. And then I run into a townhouse uh, G-Bus emulation. Basically, this has just kind of got a little different characteristics than uh, typical SSL G-Bus. And I really like the harmonics behind it. But uh, typically what I got going on here is a ratio of 4 to 1. My attack is at uh, 10, 10 milliseconds. And my release is, what is that, minus 1. Basically the fastest release and almost slowest attack that you can get. And then you can play with your gain a little bit. But I'm aiming for about 2 to 3 dB. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I want- And I don't want to forget this, because this is huge. And this is one of the reasons I use this instead of some of the other G-Buses. Because I'm not, if I, I can't remember correctly, but I was thinking they might not all have a sidechain filter. Don't hold me to that, but check this out. Pay attention to the low end and the way the bass is really reacting to the uh, compressor. And then we'll engage the sidechain. Basically anywhere from 100 to 150 hertz, and it really allows the bass to pass through. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a steep, it's a matter of time. I'm fucking that bitch with no brakes, sipping this lean out of state. Out of space. Look at these pros, I got cake. So I'm liking how that's sitting. You can really tell that like the bass just won't right through it, cuts through. It doesn't sound squashed, smothered, anything like that. So then after that, we're running into a imager. You know, you could use the Waves S1, uh, you could use the Ozone, any one you want, but uh, I really like the one from T-Rex. You know, it's multi-band, so you can kind of, if you want to really bring the bass back into the center, you can. If you want to throw it out you can you can just get really creative with it instead of just wide you know what i mean so i'm searching for peace looking for clarity policy diamonds i'm iris in love with the hustle i came from the struggle ain't gonna stop until i'm rich i'm on a beach popping a seal i wanna own it all slept on the street kept me a steep it's a matter of time i'm fucking that bitch with no brakes sipping this lean out of state so i ain't gonna mess with that too much um, typically I kind of stay around these settings on this one I did bump up the upper mids just a touch here 
um, just to kind of widen those out. But a lot of times I'll leave those a little bit uh, more towards the center. But I'm also doing imaging kind of throughout the whole process. You don't necessarily want to just take one imager and just blow everything up. It just doesn't really work the same. So the thing about this one is you have gain per band. So that really makes a nice adjustment there. So like, t check this out. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal, I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a steep, it's a matter of time. I'm fucking that bitch with no brakes, sipping this lean out of state. Brand new Rolls Royce out of space, look at these pros, I got cake. Kind of like pushing that low in just a little bit, and it's micro adjustments, I ain't going too crazy with it. So then after this, we got a clipper. I prefer the uh, gold clip. Definitely a go-to for me. And I'm typically aiming for like a dB, maybe a dB and a half. I'm not going too crazy with it. Um, it just makes the, the mastering process a lot easier for your limiter. And uh, yeah. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity. Policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle. Ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm on a beach, popping a seal. I wanna own it all. Slept on the street, kept me a steep. It's a matter of time. I'm fucking that bitch with no brakes. Sipping this lean out of state. Brandon Rose Rose out of space. And this blue knob down here, specifically on gold clip, just kind of smooths out the way uh, it sounds when it clips. You know, you got some uh, harmonics over here. I don't typically push that because I'm getting saturation through my Neve and my uh, Saturn II. But I like to smooth it out just a little bit. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity. Policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle. Ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. I'm and you don't want to push it too hard because then it starts to kind of sound funky. You can hear it kind of starting to break up just a little bit on that. So just very, very slight. This is where it's sounding real nice and clean. But then after that, you know, I got a limiter here just uh, as a protective ceiling. I'm searching for peace, looking for clarity, policy, diamonds, I'm iris. In love with the hustle, I came from the struggle, ain't gonna stop until I'm rich. Now I will say this, when I'm mixing, I do go ahead and bring the threshold down on the limiter. Um, just that way, you're kind of getting that sound you would get when it goes into the mastering process. So you're kind of taking off a few dB, and you can kind of just mix into that, and then that way you're not getting any kind of special surprises when it does get to mastering and things sound, start to sound squashed. You know, it just depends, but that's kind of a method for me. Um, but then before I bounce everything down, I always turn that limiter back to zero and just keep the ceiling at negative five. Just a little bit of a safety net. But y'all, I appreciate every single one of y'all. Any questions, comments, concerns, hit the chat below. I'm really trying to keep this channel growing. Let's keep a good community. And uh, there's no such thing as a dumb question. I'm here to help, and uh, I hope y'all feel the same. But I'm gonna catch y'all next week for part two. Peace.